Welcome to this tutorial where we will make a pair of cute digitigrade feet paws. And hello, I'm Mugiwara Cosplay, a fursuit maker and cosplay crafter. Sculpt a small clay model of the foot to your desired shape. Cover the model with masking tape. Carefully draw the seam lines on the tape where you want your foam pieces to join. Carefully remove the tape pattern from the clay model and flatten it. Scan the pattern into your computer. Using software like Inkscape or Photoshop, trace over the lines of your pattern and enlarge it to the actual size of your feet. Print the enlarged pattern on paper. Cut out the pattern pieces with scissors. By the way, you can also get the pattern on my shop. Trace the bottom paw piece of your pattern onto EVA foam. This will form the sturdy base of your fursuit feet. Cut out the traced shape from the EVA foam. Trace the rest of your pattern onto upholstery foam. Cut out the pieces. On the toes, some areas have to be cut beveled as shown to get the right shape when glued together. Glue the upholstery foam pieces together, forming the three-dimensional shape of the feet. Be sure to align all edges and seams neatly. Glue the completed upholstery foam shape onto the EVA foam bottoms. This forms the basic structure of your fursuit feet. The toes only get partial glued on here to make it easier to attach the shoes later on. A bit of extra support foam can also be added on the inside. Wrap the foam base in duct tape and draw your fur seam lines on this, creating a new pattern for the fur covering. Trace the tape pattern onto the back of your fur fabric. Cut out the fur pieces. For parts that will be the toes, carefully shave down the fur for a more realistic look. And then cut. Sew them together according to your pattern, taking care to align edges and match the fur direction. For the lining pattern, I did the same method as the foam paw, with a small model. Trace the pattern onto into lining fabric. Neoprene is used here.
and cut the pieces. And then sew the pieces together. Glue the lining into shoes for stability and comfort. Sew the lining to the fur for a seamless interior. You can also sew it on like this, with bias band attached. Now glue the shoe on the EVA foam bottom. Glue the foam toes proper on finely. And this how you would do it if you use the pre-made pattern from my shop. and glue the fur onto the foam bases, ensuring all parts are securely attached and aligned. Trim away extra fur if needed. By following these steps carefully, you'll be able to create a pair of fursuit feet that are both durable and aesthetically pleasing. Remember, crafting fursuits is an art, so don't hesitate to put your personal touch on your creation. And if you are new here, I make a lot of tutorials on how to make fursuits and creature cosplays so make sure to hit that subscribe button if you want to learn more. See you in the next video.